Well, hello YouTube world. Hasn't it been a while? I hope you're all doing well. Sorry I've been away for so long. Let's just say a few things have happened. Anyway, back to the topic. Today we're going to review a Warrior Mini. I'm not sure if you're getting that clear, but if you're not, it doesn't matter. There's a photo coming. Stand by and here we go. Roll the photo. Okay guys, so what do I think of this little torch? I think it's the best 18650 Olight has made. It's got all the modes. It's got the five five levels from Firefly to Turbo. I'm going to put the specs up on the uh, screen right now for you to see. So stand by for that. Pause your video if you need to. Okay. Typical Olight fashion. Recharges in the back. Again, I'll post the photos. You know the story clip it on, let it go. You don't need to take the battery out of the torch. That's just absolutely fantastic. I love that. Just That's why I love Olight, actually. It's simply the, the ease of recharging the batteries. Nobody wants to be fluffing around, pulling batteries out and throwing them on the charger and then leaving it on overnight and forgetting about it. Let's move on now. Ergonomics. Again, perfect. Exactly the right size for these potato fingers. I can at least grab it enough. Um, I don't mind if it would be a little bit bigger, but remember, this is more of an EDC, yeah? This is not going to be the torch that you're going to uh, have to store in a box. You put it in your pocket and you do what you need to do. You've got it there. It's just on that level of being small enough, and uh, I like it. So, what I'm going to do now, guys, is uh, it is dark. We're going to go out, we're going to take some footage. I'm going to show you photos, I'm going to show you videos, make a small comparison to give you an idea what it's like. On my left hand, Warrior Mini. On my right hand, M2R Pro. Okay, Warrior Mini shaking now, M2R shaking now. If you have a look, similar beam pattern, different colour. This one is warmer, the M2R Pro is warmer. Warrior Mini is more of a cool white. As you can see, both on turbo, they don't seem like they're that far apart. But, in actual fact, in the distance, you can really tell the difference. Pay close attention to the photos. All right, now coming back at you. M2R doing circles on my right, your left. Warrior Mini on my left, your right. So, what do you think? Because there's such, such a concentrated spots, it's quite easy to show them side by side and demonstrate how they work. So hopefully this gives you an idea. I would say, call this one the big brother of this one. They've got the same five modes. They've got similar beam pattern. Cool white on the little baby, warm white on the bigger baby. Both very, very good. S1R Baton 2 on my left. Basically, the little baby, little baby Olight. On my right, the Warrior Mini. Hopefully, you can see some differences. So what do I think about the torch? It's pretty good. 
I think it's got a decent beam. It's got a decent balance. Mostly a concentrated sort of a beam. Not so much a spreader. Um, I love the five modes. You know, you've got your firefly mode and then all the way up to turbo in five stops. So, you know, that's, that's pretty versatile, just like the M2R. Now, hold for the intermission, another aeroplane coming. We live near an airport where we've just recently moved, and I absolutely had no idea. You know, because of COVID, all the aeroplanes had stopped. Now, Australia is back in, I wouldn't say full force, but see, can you hear it? Hmm. Okay, gonna stop again. Now there's, uh, there's been a bit of controversy about this, uh, this little baby. Apparently people have been burning their pockets. Well, guys, come on, what do you expect? 1,500 lumens, such a small head, concentrated light. Yeah, of course it's going to burn a hole in your pocket. Put the thing on lockout and hope for the best. Anyway, iLight's offered a solution. They've um, introduced this little... Ooh, someone let off a firecracker. They've introduced this little... Uh, it's like a white silicon type of a... Almost looks like a condom that is supposed to go on the back of the button which I'm going to throw a picture up just now. Just one second. Here we go. Picture up. Okay. So what that also does, it acts as a diffuser. So, you know, you turn the light on and it ends up giving you uh, more of a spread than a concentrated spot. So, you know, it it's not a bad idea. It kills two birds with one stone. And then when you turn it off, it glows green. Like, it's pretty gimmicky, but it's all right. It's pretty good. So, guys, I'm going to some effort. Show me some love. Give me the thumbs up. Give me the subs up. Comment down below. And see you on the next video. By the way, click here or here to see another video.